So you see the Walwale Adam Smith's handiwork. Another thing you will find yesterday with Adam Smith, Adam Smith simply said, what our colleague Adam Smith must know is that, Adam Smith, what do you want to do this to future generations? Adam Smith was a Scottish political economist and philosopher. He has become famous by his influential book, The Wealth of Nations, published in 1776. Smith was the son of the comptroller of the customs at Kirkcaldy, 5, Scotland. The exact date of his birth, according to history, is unknown. At the age of about 15, Smith proceeded to Glasgow University, studying moral philosophy under the never-to-be-forgotten Francis Hutchison, as Smith called him. In 1748, he began delivering public lectures in Edinburgh under the patronage of Lord Camus. Some of these dealt with rhetoric and Bell's letters, but later he took up the subject of the progress of opulence, and it was then in his middle or late twenties that he first expounded the economic philosophy of the obvious and simple system of natural liberty, which he was later to proclaim to the world in his inquiry into the nature and causes of the wealth of nations. In 1751, Smith was appointed Professor of Logic at Glasgow University, transferring in 1752 to the Chair of Moral Philosophy. His lectures covered the field of ethics, rhetoric, jurisprudence, and political economy, or police and revenue. Adam Smith is touted as fluent and persuasive. Shortly before his death, Smith had nearly all his manuscripts destroyed. So where does Dr. Muhammad Dubaumia fit in Adam Smith's theory? Your guess is as good as mine.